I spent 100 days in Lucky Block Pixelmon, the mod that combines Pokemon and Minecraft. Each day I get to open one Lucky Block and these Lucky Blocks can give anything from a Caterpie to a legendary Pokemon. But that's not all. There's also a small chance to upgrade our Lucky Blocks to Uncommon, Epic, and maybe Legendary, which would just be insane. My goals for this challenge are to get a full team of shiny Pokemon, beat all eight gyms, and steal three Pokemon in the war zone from other players. And if you guys want to play this for yourselves, the IP for the server is mc.pokesmash.co, also in the description. So here we are on the Zekrom server. And something you might notice immediately is that I do not have a starter Pokemon. But that is completely fine because we're going to get our starter Pokemon from one of these lucky blocks right here. I don't think I can put lucky blocks down here. So we're just going to RTP and I guess just go for it, man. Oh, man, I am so nervous. So this Pokemon could be amazing or it could just be the worst thing ever. If I get a Caterpie as my starter, I might as well just stop the challenge now. So really quick, one thing that's super cool about these lucky blocks is that there's actually different tiers, meaning there's a small chance we'll actually get an upgrade and have a way bigger shot at getting a better starter Pokemon. And also, if you guys end up enjoying the video, don't forget to subscribe. I am a new channel here on YouTube and any support would mean a lot. But all right, no more waiting. Let's go ahead and open our first ever lucky block and get our starter pokemon oh my god come on what's it gonna be what's it gonna be a, a drizzile all right that is a starter but can we catch it though but can we ca and we caught it let's go so there we go we have our starter and it's actually a real starter pokemon love that let's go look at our buddy i think i'm just gonna spend the rest of the day trying to train him up so i'll catch up with you guys when i'm done with that all right here we why am i inside of it i want <laughs> What's going on? What is going on? My Pokemon's evolving and I'm looking inside of it. I'm scared. Your Drizzle evolved into an Inteleon. That was terrifying, but hey, look. Our starter evolved. Okay, so we're on a day two and what better way to start it off than simply by opening a lucky block. Okay, baby. Okay, baby. Okay, baby. Okay, baby. It would be so sick to get a legendary from this, but let's see what we got in our second lucky block. Oh, a Boltund. And there we go. We caught it. That's actually really good because the first gym is an electric type and having Inteleon was not helping us. So at least we have a Pokemon to resist it. But yo, and he's even got an electric move. What a lad. What a lad. So I guess I got to go get this dude trained up. I feel like this is how I'll be spending a lot of the time early games simply because I don't have to worry about catching other Pokemon. Like I just get one Pokemon every day. So all I can really do is train it up and just worry about beating the gyms. And the gyms aren't even the coolest part. I need to get ready for the war zone. If you guys don't know what the Pixelmon war zone is, essentially it's a battle royale where you have to fight trainers and the winner gets to steal a Pokemon from the loser. So if I want to steal five Pokemon in the war zone, I'm going to have to win five battles, which means my team has to be amazing. So uh, hopefully that explains all the training. Something I forgot about is that you start with rare candy. So let me just sneak a few levels on in the homies. We got both level 40. Oh, and if you guys didn't know, there's actually these blue Pokestops around the map that you can come up to and hit and they give you free rewards. But we still have a little bit of time left in the day, so I'm going to try out EV training. And since both of our Pokemon are fast special attackers, I'm going to be spending a lot of time with these Gengars and Cinderaces. So I just realized I spent all that time training up Bolton special attack just to realize it has two physical moves. But that's okay, because hopefully we'll be able to teach some later on. Either way, it's a new day, and apparently it's snowing out, so maybe we'll get an Ice-type Pokemon from this lucky block. Who knows, but what will be our third Pokemon of this adventure? Uh, I don't even want to say this Pokemon's name out loud. That is honestly laughable. Hey, I, I love its evolution. My Lodic is great, but that is not a good starting point. But uh, hey, we got a Feebas. I don't know, guys. This honestly has me a bit scared for the first electric gym. I don't know what we're going to do. Like, we got to take on electric Pokemon, and we have two water types and an electric type. So uh, I, I think it's safe to say I need to spend the next couple days training again. So what about this? I spend the next couple days training up the team, and when I come back, we open all the lucky blocks at once. So after spending a lot of time here in the EV training room, it's time to go open some lucky blocks. I need to think about saving up money so I can get these uh, EV power items to make it a... Oh, my God. These Ludicolo colos won't stop screaming. I'm just trying to talk and say that I should probably save up money to buy items and Ludicolo's having a field day. But anyways, you know what we need to do was RTP. We're on top of a tree. And it is now day eight, meaning it's time to open five more lucky blocks. I spent the last five days training, so let's make up for it right here. Oh no, I don't know where I want to start. All right, let's start with this one right here. Let's go. Ninjask. Not gonna lie, I'm not the most excited about that, but it's better than a Feebas. So that was our day four encounter. What's our day five? Oh, <gasps> yo! I don't know how I'm gonna catch this. Please stay in the ball. Stay in the ball. Dude, it's really hard to catch these flying Pokemon sometimes. No, I'm wasting all my Pokeballs. Did I get it? Oh, <gasps> we got it. All right, please stay in. Please stay in. Come on. 
Yes! Let's go. I was not trying to do that again. All right, we still got three more chances at a really big hit right here. Let's go. Oh! <gasps> <laughs> we got an upgrade. Yes. Dude, for a second, I thought we got scammed and we didn't get anything from the lucky block, but we got something even better. So if we use this upgrade, <laughs> let's do it. A great ball. It's a shiny, a shiny Metatite. So we got the advancement for, ooh, shiny. Let's go. So that marks one out of six on my goal for a full team of shiny Pokemon. We just got to get five more, but who knows? Maybe we could get one right here. Let's see. Bonettes. All right, I'll take that. Definitely one of my favorite ghost types for sure. And in the last lucky block of today, oh my gosh, <laughs> we got a Watchog. Look at Buddy run. He does not want to get caught. You are not special, bro. So with that, I think it's time to team build. Pretty sure we're just going to swap Feebas for now. Definitely one of my Lodic in the future, but for now, I think he can just sit in the PC. Dude, I am so excited about this shiny. Let's go. And I hate to say it again, but I think it's just time for more training. My goals of stealing Pokemon in the war zone and beating all the gyms all require me to have a good team, meaning I can't really progress any further. So I guess I really just got to level up the squad until it's time to take on that first gym. All right, and we're here with day 12, and look at this giant Zekrom. Oh my god. I mean, it makes sense. We are on the Zekrom server. Th did that guy just that guy just flew away on a shiny Charizard? All right. And look at this. I spent the last three days training up the best couple team members I have. I mean, I left Bonette and Ninjas, but all these guys are fully EV. Look at this. Boom. Look at that down there. So hopefully our Pokemon are strong enough now to help us out in the gym fight, which is what I want to do today. But first, we need to open some lucky blocks. So let's RTP and do that. What? Okay, dude. Okay, so this is the boss tower, I think. I was actually looking for this and we just RTP'd onto it. That's so funny. This is something I definitely want to do in this challenge, but it is called the boss tower and our team isn't amazing yet. So we're just going to leave it. All right, here we are. Let's open our lucky blocks for days 10. 10, 11, and 12. Come on, please, 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 please. A mighty N. Okay, level 48. I will take that, dude. Any high level Pokemon at this point, so good. All right, what we got next? Come on, remember, we do have a chance for an upgrade, so we can always get something better. <gasps> Speaking of something better, Dar Manitin. That is perfect. We need a fire type on our team. Yo, I think we just found our Bonnet and Ninjask replacements. I'm just saying. And for the last block, what do we have? <gasps> yes, we got an uncommon lucky block. All right, all right. Remember, last time we got a shiny, so there's another chance for one right here. Come on, man. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. <gasps> Bro, no way. We got a rare lucky block. All right, so I think there's a chance for a legendary now. Bro, this just got way more exciting. All right, I didn't think we'd get one of these so early into the challenge. I almost don't even want to open it. I just want to look at it. Look at it. It's so cool. All right, but let's waste no more time. I am so excited. What do we have from the ultra lucky block? Oh, Registeel, bro. Okay, I mean, it's not the best legendary, but it's a legendary nevertheless. Get in my Pokeball. Okay, for a second, I thought it wasn't going to stay in. Come on. And we caught it the first ball, baby. Easy. Give me that legendary achievement. That was really loud. <laughs> bro, that is actually so sick. We need to check this out right now. Come here, buddy. Come here. What's good? Yeah, like I said, not the best legendary, but it's our first, so I'll take it. All right, well, now that we have a legendary, I'm feeling a little cocky. I'm sick of training. Let's go take on the gym. And I think I got it wrong, too. I said the first was electric type. It's actually ground type. So hopefully Inteleon's gonna be able to help us here being water type, but we will see. I also have no idea what level they're gonna... Oh, oh my gosh. Thank you. Thank you. I was going to say, I don't know what level. I hope it's not over 50. And it's level 30. That's perfect. Let's do this. All right. I'm not going to mess with the rules at all. Let's just get it, bro. Select the team. Oh my God. This is not good for ground types at all. I mean, I do have Noivern, which is nice. But both of these, all of these Pokemon are weak to ground. All right. The battle started. That was weird. <laughs> you can see my healing items in the back. <laughs> I don't have a house yet, so I just threw them over there. I don't know. I just didn't know where to put them, all right? Like, guys, I'm seriously such a noob when it comes to Minecraft. Like, I, I don't know where to put my items. I don't know where to store them. Anyway, something I do know is Pokemon, and I do know we have a Gastrodon right in front of us. I'm not trying to mess around if this thing has Storm Drip. That? It's big now. Okay. Look at that. We swap into the Noivern on the ground move. Too easy. All right, so we're already at a disadvantage because I don't know how to Dynamax in this game. Do I, do I click this? I have no idea. Anyways. Oh, wait. Are they smart? No 
way the AI is actually smart. All right, but Gastron's here again, and for some reason, it's holding the Toxic Orb. Why does he have the Toxic Orb? He's just taking damage. Does he have, like, Facade? Oh, Reggie couldn't eat it. No. Sludge Wave. Knocks me out with a crit. Wow. I really wanted to jump the gun and take on these gym leaders, but I need to reassess my strats. And since you do have to take the gyms on in order, uh, I think you know what it's time to do. So I think I'm just going to spend the rest of the day leveling up Metatite to a Metacham, and then I'll catch up with you guys, and we'll open some Lucky Blocks. That might just be the smallest Seismitoad I've ever seen. <laughs> Sorry, little guy. It's time to go. And with that, though, look at our Metatite. Look at him. Our shiny Metatite is evolving. Let's go, man. It's it's long overdue, honestly. Look at that, dude. Shiny Metacham is such a good shiny. Wow. I will take that any day. So it's been a few days now since our last Lucky Block opening. We we are now on to day 14, meaning it's time to open two more lucky blocks. And what better place to do it than right here? Let's go. First lucky block gonna be a Toxel. Yo, I would love to use a Toxtricity. That is sick. And our lucky block for today, day 14, is going to be a pig. Yo, I will take another starter as well. That is perfect. I mean, it's a great fire type, but not better than Darmanitan, so he's probably just going to be in the PC. All right, so after more training, as usual, the whole... Look at the squad. The whole team is now over level 60, correct EVs on all of the Pokemon. It's time to go re-challenge the first gym. But first, it is day 17, so we need to open three more lucky blocks. So let's do that right now. All right, come on, baby. Come on, baby. The first one, let's go... A Steeny. All right, that's not too exciting. I'll take it, though. All right, what we got next? Something, anything better than a Steeny. Anything better than a Steeny. It's not hard. Oh, re that is much better than a Steeny. I will take that. It's a friendship evolution, so it's kind of annoying, but so much better than Steeny. <laughs> All right, and for our last block, come on. Maybe we'll get an upgrade. That'd be so good right now, but let's see. A, a shield on, and it's on fire. Why is it on fire? No. Isn't he weak to fire? That's just cruel, man. He just came out burning. Yo, and I know I was talking trash about Steeny, but I think before we take on the gym, I'm gonna spend some time training it up, and then we're gonna take on the ground gym leader. Hey, and there we go. After a bit of training, Steeny is evolving. Got ourselves a Serena. I still gotta level it up, get some EVs on it, and we take on the ground gym. Look at our Serena. Wait, Serena the sociable. All right, I guess he's a extrovert. Let's go. All right, quick change of plans actually instead of going and taking on the gym we're gonna go ahead and try the boss tower out i have no idea how this is gonna work how it's gonna go but let's try it the reason for this is i need some money to teach serena moves before we take the gym leader on and the boss tower is one of the best ways to make money i think you can also get the battle items such as life orb or choice specs which we definitely need so let's try it out i really don't know what else to do so i'm just gonna follow this trail and see where it takes us oh look what we have here is this the boss right here this Makar, it's level 90. Okay, this is definitely the boss. I'm going for a snipe shot. Please just kill it. Deleted. Oh, okay. So that's how you do get items. Sweet. So we got the scope lens. That's actually really useful. So I'm not really sure how this works, but do they just keep spawning in here and we just keep going up? Oh, Thunderstone. Beautiful. Whoa, we got this giant green Arcanine now. All right, come here, buddy. Level 90 as well. Does so much damage. Hit this Hydro Pump. Of course not. Good thing Noivern's here to flinch it to death. Oh, I got a fossil. No way. I mean, I can't use that in this challenge, but that's pretty cool. I wonder if that sells for a lot. All right, so now that I know that this is Boss Tower, I wonder what that weird glass structure was that we found a few days ago. Yo, look at this super cool Mew I found over by the Boss Tower. It's just chilling up there. But for now, I think all we... I don't know what else to do. All right, we're just gonna go take all the gym. We're gonna raw dog it, and we're gonna see if we can win. I'd like to go into this battle as overprepared as possible, but like I said, guys, my Minecraft knowledge is nothing to my Pokemon knowledge, so my Pixelmon knowledge is still in the works. I'm working with what I have, all right? But I do think it's time for us to take on the ground gym one more time. Man, I come here to take the gym on, and this dude's already fighting it. <laughs> like, okay. I guess we already knew they had a gash it on. Oh, he's small. But the team is finally ready to take on the gym again. We're gonna lead with Serena because we know they lead Gashadon, and we're just gonna make this work. All right, I'm not losing again to the gym leader, and I don't know why they're in the ground, but as long as they can battle, I'm okay with that. There we go. All right, Steelix goes down to Registeel. All right, this is the one we win. This is the one we win. I'm not losing another time. Gashadon comes back out. I'm really not worried about about this. I honestly might just explode. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. I don't need Registeel anymore. Brings in Zy- What? The first gym has a legendary. I mean, they had a mega, so I should have honestly known, but jeez. Okay, I was not prepared for this at all. So we got Zy- I love how he's trapped in the ground. <laughs> 
All right, let's go for a drop kick. This is where we win. This is where we win. Oh my gosh, yes. We dragon pulse, and then I finish off Runarigus. And just like that, we have beaten the first gym. Look at that, we got a muscle band too. I'm gonna give that to Darmanitan. We got two lucky eggs. That is beautiful. And we got our first gym badge. Let's go. Bro, honestly, that's got me pretty cocky. I just wanna see if we can take on the second gym leader right now. I mean, this could just be the saddest attempt at a gym leader fight, but we're gonna try it. The rock type gym. Oh, that's an Aerodactyl. Oh, this is not starting good. All right, so just like our first attempt on the first gym, unfortunately, we have lost. But lucky for me, we do have some lucky blocks to open. So hopefully we'll get some better Pokemon to take on the rest of these gyms. We mostly just need better Pokemon so I can finish off the gyms, which is one of my goals. And also enter the war zone. Because in the war zone, the tier is anything goes, meaning you can bring literally any Pokemon. So like Mega Rayquaza is the cat pretty much. So if I'm going to compete with players like that trying to steal their Pokemon, I need to have some good Pokemon. And since it's day 21, that means we get to open four more lucky blocks. So here we go. Let's get right into it. Oh, a Seedra. Yo, I will take that any day of the week. I have no idea how to get a dragon scale to evolve it, but I will take it. That's also definitely going to help in the rock gyms. All right, next lucky block going to be another great Pokemon for the gym. Sweet. Dude, I should have opened these before we tried. Next up, uh, that's not really great for the gym, but it's still a really good Pokemon very fast. I'll take in a Selgor. And last but not least, the final lucky block before I start grinding for the rock gym. A Tauros. Oh, Okay, I guess I'll just take these dudes back to the training area and get to work. This toxicity does not look right, but it looks cool. I will take it. It just doesn't look correct. And with the help of our good friend, Cyrude, look at this. Our Seedra is evolving. Beautiful. Dude, this is going to be such a good help. Not even in just the rock gym. This is just a great Pokemon to have. Thanks, Cyrude. Everyone say thanks, Cyrude. All right. So if you take a look at the team, we got Inteleon, Kingdra, Walrein, Red. Registeel, Serena, and Metacham. May also notice I have my first level 100 Pokemon. Metacham is level 100. So let's go. I mean, not that it matters in this battle. Everything's going to be level 40. But we're going to go ahead and do this. I completely forgot what they led off with. So, oh yeah, it's Aerodactyl. This is not good. I'm going to bring in Metacham here and just fire off a high jump kick and really hope it kills something. Aerodactyl. Oh, okay. Cradily died. That's why Aerodactyl's here. All right. I have Rain Dance Focus Energy Kingdra with Swift Swim. We got the Scope Lens. Dude, we're going to be doing a lot of damage but we just got to wait for the right time. Okay, here is Shuckle. I need to kill this ASAP. There we go. Aerodactyl's here. Guys, this is looking good. Aerodactyl goes down and we have beaten the second gym leader. Let's go, baby. Oh my gosh, and the gems don't go away after you use them. That Oh, maybe it's just because it was a gym battle, but we got a Sooth Bell. That would have been very helpful for Riolu. But that's two out of the eight gyms down. We're a quarter away to that goal. That is great progress. All right, well, I spent a few days grinding up the squad. Look, we got Darmanitan back on the team because we're about to take on the steel gym leader it's time to take on the third one i got my team ready with items i got a fire gem here water grass steel and now we have scope lens with sniper i got an ability capsule changed up the ability so now we really got a team it feels like let's put it to the test and lead off with darmanitan to see what we're gonna do oh it's a corviknight oh we're so screwed i honestly feel like he's gonna swap out i'm going for u-turn oh there we go hurt itself and confuse hit another high jump kick there we go hit itself and confuse serena putting in the work, taking out Corvin. Bro, if we win this, it's literally because of Serena. I'm not even kidding. There we go, baby. We won. First try to... Hey, hey, I know there's two of you, but I beat both of you. Seriously, I don't know what glitch is going on, but I'm, I'm kind of here for it. It's hilarious. All right, you know what? I'm feeling pretty good coming off that win. What do you say we open up a few lucky blocks? It took me a while to get the team ready for that, so I know we got some to open. Let's do it right now. All right, let's crack right into these seven lucky blocks. What we got first... Oh, a munch. I will take that. It doesn't get much better than munchlax, does it? No way. Let's see. Oh, never mind. It gets much better. All right. We're going to save that for the end, though. We're going to save that for the end. We got an uncommon. We have not been getting a lot of upgrades at all. That is awesome to see. All right. Next up, we have a quillfish. But of course, you cannot forget about... A Torchic. Dude, I love getting the starters. I will take that. Give it to me. But we definitely don't need starters. We need shinies to complete our goal. So that's why I'm so excited to open this uncommon one here. All right. Come on. What are we going to get? Let's see. What did I say about starters? All right, come on. We got three lucky blocks left. Let's see what we're going to get. Anything that can help us out with the dark gym would be great as well. Oh, an Avalog. As soon as that thunder sound, that actually kind of scared me. I'm not going to lie, but look at this. After Legends Arceus, kind of feels weird seeing normal Avalog. I'm not going to lie. All right, the last lucky block before we check out this great one. Let's see what it's going to be. Maybe another upgrade. Who knows? 
and it's a Slurpuff. Okay, but the moment we have all been waiting for, what's gonna be in this uncommon block? It could be an upgrade, it could be a shiny. I just hope it's good. Let's see. And it is a shiny. It is a shiny Grookey, a starter as well. I will definitely take that. Unfortunately, it doesn't really help us out with the Dark Gym, but it is a shiny and gets us one step closer of our goal to a full shiny squad. But just like that, man, we beat the third gym on our first try. Let's take on the fourth. And here we are at the Dark Gym Leader, and they're facing the... Hey, what's going on? I guess they're camera shy or something. All right, well, here's the fourth gym leader. Let's just go ahead and do this. I'm gonna lead off with Darmanitan and hopefully we can just kill something right away. And there's a Sableye. It's a mega Sableye. Okay, I was not expecting that. Hopefully we just one shot it here with flare bullets. That would be so clean. We are fire gem boosted and we do kill. Nice, Sableye goes down. The water shuriken is definitely not going to be enough. The dragon pulse is though, and we can finish off the muck. And there we go. We got our fourth gym badge on the first try again. Get destroyed, but yo, Oh, the coolest thing is that we just got a life orb for beating that so we can give life orb to our sheer four star manitan Oh, that is so good. And we also got a choice band, which is just ridiculous <laughs> Wait, I'm trying to go to the mart and this dude is flying on a Mewtwo. Oh my god Yo, I'm on the GTS right now and this is a mega stone Rayquaza NFT. Just why? Why? And just like that, I've evolved our Munchlax into a Snorlax. I'm gonna try and use this guy for the Psychic Gym just so we get some extra bulk. Let's go. All right, so after a few attempts, I was not only able to beat the fourth gym, but I was also able to beat the fifth gym, which was Psychic type. And man, these gyms are getting hard. So if I wanna have any luck going forward, I think we definitely need to open up some lucky blocks. And we're here on day 45, meaning we have 12 lucky blocks to open right now. And there we go, we got them all laid out. Let's go ahead and open the first lucky block. Come on, man, we need some legendaries if we want any luck in these gym fights. And that is not a legendary. Next up, we have a low tad, all right. I'm pretty sure this is a wild spinner act. I don't wanna accidentally catch that. Next up, come on, man, we need an upgrade. We need an up, oh, I'll take a Sigalift though. That's pretty sweet. Definitely not an upgrade, but it, it's something. All right, come on, man, we need some power. We need some power. That's some power. I mean, not in the rain. I feel bad for Buddy right now, but that is powerful. Oh, that is so good. Oh, Weavile, thank you. Oh, that's amazing. So good for the flying gym too. Oh, and a Syndic. Okay, I'll take starters. I love my starter Pokemon. Come on, man. We're down to the last five lucky blocks. Remember, one of our goals is to get a full team of shiny Pokemon, meaning we need to get these great upgrades if we want to have a chance at that. Also, I just realized I think I'm a little off on my math because we're on day 45 right now, meaning we should have 55 lucky blocks in my inventory. So I guess we'll just open up some more to make up for it. There we go. I think the math should check out now. Hopefully, I didn't mess anything up, but hey, we got some more blocks to open. I I am never gonna complain about that. And look at this. Hey, we got my boy Cyrude, a little baby Cyrude. Oh, a tro- Oh, get in my ball. Get in my ball, buddy. I think I'm the first person to get excited for a Tropius, but hey, I'll take it. Come on, man. We need a great upgrade. We need a great- Why is it on fire? Why? <laughs> it's already terrible. Why did they have to make it on fire? Bro, are we really about to go through this whole batch and not get a single upgrade? All right, so I cannot catch this Swellow for the life of me, so I'm just gonna open the rest of these blocks and let them chill up there. Oh, there we go. Finally got an upgrade. Man, this could be a shiny, or we could get another upgrade and get a possible legendary here. Please, man. I don't know which one I want more, honestly. So let's just open it and see what we got. Come on, man. The luck. And it is a shiny, a really good shiny as well. Pretty bulky. We got a shiny Dusclops baby. And just like that, we are halfway to our goal of a full shiny squad. Well, being almost halfway through all of our lucky blocks. So I say we're relatively on pace. All right, come on, man. We could get another upgrade right here though. But we got an Ivysaur, which I will definitely take. Oh my gosh, we actually got another upgrade. No way. I'm putting it right there. Let's open this one first. It's a Vespa Quinn. Come on, man. Can we get another shiny? Let's see. <gasps> Oh, not only do we get a shiny, but we get a shiny of one of my favorite Pokemon. <laughs> like, I know there might not be that many people who get excited for Huntail, but I am definitely one of these people. He's so funny, man. And we got a shiny one, too. So we are only two shiny Pokemon away from the full shiny squad. Of course, I'll level them all up, get the whole team ready once we get all six shinies. But that is so cool, man. All right, well, we're here on day 48, and something I've realized is I don't have a house. I don't have a place to live. I don't have a place to sleep or put my things. So that's what we're going to do now. And I think this seems like the perfect spot to go ahead and build our house. So I'll catch up with you guys when we're done with that. 
Oh my god, this is gonna be so terrible. All right, well, wow, a couple days have gone by, but here is our house. It's small, I know, but it gets the job done. It's got windows, so you know what? Could be way worse. We got everything we need in here. It it does the job. I know everyone's probably gonna be roasting my building skills in the comments, but remember, guys, my Minecraft knowledge is way worse than my Pokemon knowledge. I'm doing the best I can. And I think this is the perfect spot to go ahead and open up our next batch of lucky blocks, which is seven blocks. So let's get it going and open these blocks. I don't think you guys realize how bad we need another legendary. If I want to have any chance in the war zone, we got to start getting more legendary Pokemon. All right, what do we got? First block, baby, is gonna... Oh, I mean, we already have that. That's really not exciting, actually. I already have one of these. Hopefully, this block will be a little... Di Dude, I have one of these too. Is this a joke? We just got two Pokemon in a row that we already have. There's no way. Come on, man. Come on. I know this is in the shape of an L, but can we please take a W here? Please? A stamp. Ah! His model looks hilarious in this game. We got the Origami Stantler. Or I guess we got the Porygon Stantler. That's really what it looks like. But what will these last three lucky blocks give us? Let's find out right now. Come on, man. Come on. That's really solid. Dude, a Croconaut. I will take that. We got an Electric Gym coming up, though, so ground types are preferred. Preferable. Come on, man. Give me a ground type. That's literally weak to electric. It couldn't have gone worse, but we got one block left. Come on, man. The day 52 block. Please bless us. <gasps> yes. Yes. Oh my God. We got an upgrade. All right. So remember guys, we currently have four shiny Pokemon. So if this is a shiny right here, we're only one away from our goal of getting a full shiny team. But then again, we could also get an upgrade and possibly get a legendary here. So I don't know which one I want more. Let's see what's inside. A shiny Machoke. Okay, I will definitely take that. Let's go. And just like I said, with that, we are one shiny away from completing our goal. Let's go, man. Dude, that really sucks. None of our new Pokemon help out with electric types. I don't know what I'm going to do for the squad for this gym. I got to figure that out. So I think the plan now is just going to be to train up as many Pokemon as I can to be ready for the last two gym fights. And as soon as we're done with all these gyms, that's when we're going to start getting ready for the war zone, which is going to be intense. Like I said before, if you win a match in the war zone you can actually steal a pokemon from your opponent so we need to make sure our pokemon are good enough for that all right so it's a new day let's start it off right with opening a singular lucky block not as exciting as opening a bunch but who knows this one lucky block could be something amazing let's see and it's it's a Nuzleaf. All right. Not a highlight of my Pixelmon career by any means. But it's fine because I'm only set on one thing today, and that's beating the last two gyms. The only thing standing in the way of my goal of completing all eight gym battles is the last two gyms being Electric and Dragon. So I'm going to go get my Pokemon ready for the seventh gym fight, and I'll catch up with you guys when it's time for the final gym battle. And here we are at the final gym battle battle level 100 i've got a king tree is 98 so hopefully we'll be fine but i've got no idea what they lead with i'm just gonna lead register oh wait that's actually really good they lead altaria we won yes literally first attempt and i had a pokemon who was level 98 that was the easiest gym fight yet yo you thought your level 100 mods were scary and with that guys we've completed our first goal beating all eight gyms in the Rayquaza League. Let's go. Dude, I really thought that was gonna take a few tries. That gives me a lot of confidence going into the war zone. And what a better way to celebrate beating the eighth gym than to open some lucky blocks. All right, man, let's get it right here. Come on, let's get some magic. We deserve it. That's actually really good. A Gliscor would really help. Next up, what do we got? What do we got? A come on, not as exciting. Come on, man. It would be so nice to have another legendary to go in the war zone with. Let's see. Come on. That is not a legendary. I can't express how far that is away from a legendary Pokemon. I'm astonished. Pinsir, though. I'll take that. Come on, man. Only three more. Impress me. Oh, that is sick. A Gigalith, bro. Yes. I'll take any fully evolved Pokemon, especially one that evolves with trade. That's just one more thing I don't have to do. And what will the last two lucky blocks be? Honestly, I'm pretty satisfied after that Gigalith, but I'm definitely satisfied with an Oshawott. This is one of my favorite starter Pokemon. Get in the ball, buddy. But what do we have here for the final lucky block? What's it gonna be oh my you gotta be kidding me it's almost like i didn't even open a lucky block we could have just skipped that day oh my god i was so hoping we get another shiny there so we could just cross off two gold pretty much at once 
but unfortunately, that's not the case. So we just gotta hope that with our remaining 40 lucky blocks, we get at least one more shiny Pokemon, which definitely seems doable. However, if I wanna make sure I complete all my goals, I definitely need to start focusing on getting Pokemon ready for the war zone, which if you don't remember, if you battle someone in the war zone and lose, they can actually steal one of your Pokemon. So if I don't want any of my precious Pokemon taken away from me, I gotta make sure the team is good. All right, so after doing a ton of training, look, I got the whole squad over here level 100, all of these Pokemon level 100. It is time to go into the war zone, but first, let's go ahead and open up some lucky blocks. It's day 71, so we got 11 more blocks. Would you look at that? It perfectly made a W. I don't know. I hope that means we're going to take some Ws today, maybe with these blocks, hopefully in the war zone, but we'll see. All right, first block of this session is going to be a polywag. Next week, oh! baby yo that is actually so good dusknur get in my ball oh, come on i know there's gonna be some power in this next block i know there's gonna be some power let's go <laughs> i mean it's a cool pokemon i like swana but it's definitely not power so i guess i was wrong but this time th oh that is actually so good that is such a good bulky pokemon i mean that's like what my team is i got dusclops i got registeel so pokemon like that are so good and competitive pokemon that are not like bellsprout all right come on man the next but oh skull of Bro, there's no way. There's no way. Oh, I didn't. <laughs> this is completely unintentional. All right, no comment. Next block. Thank you. All right, it was a sign. We got the upgrade. Let's go, baby. Come on, man. It would actually be so nice to get another legendary before attempting the war zone. I mean, I'm going to keep this team, but it is a shiny Caterpie. So the final shiny for our full shiny squad is going to be a Caterpie. And with that, I've just got to train the team up and we've completed a goal. But no premature celebration. We got to wait to open these. No way. There's actually no way. Look at us. All right, let's open the rest of them. That is that is so good. Yes. Bulldor, we already have a Gigalith. And Electrike, which is actually... Okay, Bulldor was on a run there. But dude, let's go. We got another upgrade. Come on, man. Come on, please. I'll take another shiny, but at this point, I would level... And I just... I, I leveled up. I'm not sure what these random Pokemon things are, but they aren't lucky blocks, so I'm just gonna stay away from them. Did you see Poliwag trying to break into my house? I'm sorry, but these doors... These doors are just too reinforced. This is state of the art crafting technology right here. You've never seen it before. No more waiting. Let's get to this last lucky block. Come on, man. What's it gonna be? An upgrade, please? Yes! Oh, finally, we got another rare lucky block. We could get a legendary here, but of course, it can go even further, and we could get a legendary block, so let's see what it's gonna be. It's... Ooh! We got our first Ultra Beast, which is a Kartana, man. I will take that. That's also just a really good Pokemon to have. It's level 70 as well. I need to get this trained up, but it's time to do the thing I've been scared about the entire video. Oh my god, it, oh. And here we, oh my god, bro, oh. <laughs> Right off spot, there's someone right there. Chill on me, man, chill. All right, so I have no idea what to expect out of the war zone here. What's up, my boy? How you doing? Just please don't battle me, okay? Dude, there is a lot of people over here. I mean, fighting someone is inevitable. I'm not just gonna run away from people. That's not the point of the war zone. Oh my God, look at that. It says that dude just stole a Como from someone. Wow, is this a sticky web team? That is so bad for us. I can't explain how astronomically bad that is for us. Yep, okay, yep, here it is. Here's the sticky web. He went for Z hypnosis, bro. The game's just over. I don't even know what the Z moves do. I don't even have Z moves, bro. This is so bad. I'm gonna lose my starter. This guy's a really good battler, and he's got a really good team, it seems. So, hey, shout out to him. Hopefully, he doesn't steal our starter Pokemon. Why did I make this a goal? And after losing that last battle, I know that we have a lot to learn about the war zone, and we don't have legendaries, so we just gotta work with what we have, and I gotta, I gotta be ready for everything. But we got Serena on the team now. Let's try out the war zone one last time. Dude, I am, I'm still so very scared, but hey, I wanna give it one more go. See if we can get at least one stolen Pokemon today. But you, the guy who stole my Registeel, you can stay far away from me. GG though. That was actually a really good battle. You played really well. I was actually really impressed by that sticky web team. Not a bad build at all. But for the sake of confidence, let's just pretend like that never happened and we gotta find our first victim, all right? Bro, all these people have like intimidating tags next to their name, like legend or like mythic. Dude, I'm just, I'm just Arpus, bro. All right, man, here we go. Our second battle in the war zone. Oh my God. That's a Xerneas. That, what am I supposed to do? I'm just going to click Sludge Bronze. Oh, we have we have a Focus Sash. This could literally just end the battle here. So I need to, I need to do damage. Dude, Registeel is such a good Pokemon to just have gone. No! 
that's a loss again, bro. Yep, and that's the end of the battle, and we are... We are out. We need a better team, but we can't open other blocks, so I don't know what to do. Dude, he took my shiny dust clops, bro. All right, well, coming off those devastating Warzone losses, not only the battles, but losing our shiny dust clops as well as our only legendary Pokemon, Registeel. And we do have this Kartana on my team, but that's an Ultra Beast. We have four more lucky blocks to open. Let's go ahead and get this done, man. All right, man, our first one, what's it gonna be? Bro, let's go. We actually got an upgrade. That is so nice. This is so clutch because we lost our shiny dusk nor meaning we actually undid our goal. So hopefully we get another shiny here or we could even get an ultra block. Oh, no way. We got an upgrade block. So let's go. We actually have a chance to get a legendary Pokemon right here, right now. Come on, man. Please, please. Oh, and it's a Lunala. Yes, dude, that is, that's actually a really good one too. I'll take that. All right, well, we got three more blocks. Hopefully we get blessed again, please. Oh my, yes. Yes, bro. Give me a Metagross. That is free. Well, it's not a Metagross yet, but it will be. That's actually another pretty cool Pokemon of Morgrim. Not bad. I don't know why I'm throwing Master Balls at it. But for the last lucky block, what are we going to get? Oh, no way, dude. We actually got another great upgrade. Come on, man. Come on. No way we get another legendary right here. Dude, this is this is what we need. This is what we need. Survey says... <laughs> there is actually no way. We got another... Oh, my gosh. All right. Come on. Please be another legendary. Come on. It's a Victini. All right. I'll take it. Not the best in the world, but hey, it's definitely a legendary. Let's go. People in chat asking what legendary I just got, bro. I'm not telling you. You were trying to fight me in the war zone. So, I guess it's just back to the drawing board. We got to figure out the best team to hop into the war zone with. We gotta avenge our fallen Dusclops, our fallen Registeel and show them that we can steal Pokemon. And we also need to get one more shiny so we can re-complete our goal of a full shiny team. Okay, I would like to redirect your attention to our team. I got the remaining Pokemon up to level 100. We got EVs on the whole squad. And it's time for us to set foot back into the war zone. Honestly, guys, I'm terrified but not only do we need to go into the war zone to complete our goal we also need to avenge our stolen pokemon i don't know if we'll be able to steal those specific pokemon back but if we can steal pokemon in their place i think we'll be doing them justice and here we are oh my god man i gotta be careful who i'm fighting in here bro the last thing i want is to lose another one of our pokemon and i think we found our first opponent right here all right man we're gonna lead off with kartana that's his okay well that's that's starting off poorly. Bro, we need this win. I really need this. Come on. And here's the Zacian, but can we take this out in one hit? That's the real question. Zacian goes down, and we have won our first battle. I think I know what we need to do. And just like that, we have stolen Zacian. Let's freaking go, bro. Everyone, take a look at our brand new Zacian. Let's go. This is gonna help out so much in the war zone. Alright, but what better way to celebrate our first win in in the war zone with opening some lucky blocks. I'm actually gonna go to a different spot. We've opened... Okay, we're on trees. I was just trying to get a new scenic place. We've opened a lot of blocks by my house, but this looks like the perfect island to open nine more lucky blocks. Remember, guys, we are only one shiny Pokemon away from completing our goal of a team of shinies. So if we get a shiny from this batch, then we'll only have to win two more battles in the war zone, and we've officially completed all of our goals for this 100-day challenge. Well, let's not get too ahead of ourselves. Let's just start opening... Oh! Okay, well, I was gonna get excited and then I realized we already have one of these. All right I guess I got too ahead of myself, which is what I said not to do. That's a grubbin. All right, nothing too crazy so far Come on, man. Yes. Yes, that's what i'm talking about. All right guys This could be it. We could complete our challenge right here. You know what? I'm actually gonna save that one for the end We're gonna open these first. Us. Okay. I, I should have just opened it. Let's go. Let's go. Ooh, wait a phalanx That's sweet, but since the war zone goal depends on how good of pokemon we have I really shouldn't be celebrating and Unless it's a legendary. But hey, man, I just like cool Poke in there. See, I'll celebrate for that. We got another upgrade. Come on, man. Let's go. Whoa, a Grimer. I'll take it. Did we just get another? Oh, no, it's a Litleo. I just, I thought we got another upgrade. It's just a very small Litleo. But come on, man. The last common lucky block before we break open. Then, oh, it's a Cranidos. All right, I cut myself off. But that's actually a sweet Pokemon. All right, here we go. Uncommon lucky blocks. What are we going to get, man? We could get a shiny and complete our goal. What's it going to be? 
And there it is, a shiny, and just like that, as long as I don't get any of them stolen and we train them all up, we've officially completed our goal of a full team of shiny Pokemon. But let's see, man, maybe we can just get another legendary too. That would be something to celebrate about. Come on, come on. No way! No way! We actually got an upgrade. I really didn't think that was gonna happen. All right, guys, come on. What legendary can we get? As long as it's not a duplicate, this could really help out. Let's see. Come on, come on, come on. No way! We got an epic lucky block! All right, the first time we've gotten at this challenge, I'm pretty sure. I can't remember. Maybe we got one earlier. Honestly, guys, it's been a while. I've been recording this over the span of a couple weeks, so excuse me if my memory's a little dry. But either way, let's celebrate and open this master lucky block. Come on, man. And it's a shiny Deoxys. There is no way, bro. Get in my Pokeball. Holy crap. Imagine that. We get a full team of legendaries Well getting a full team of shinies as well. Deoxys, I don't know why you're sleepy, bro. I'm gonna need you awake, but dude, that is so exciting. All right, well, I guess let's try to find our next victim in the war zone. I mean, this is definitely the best team we've had so far. If there's any chance of taking on these guys, it's with this squad. And I think we found our next victim right here. I just got to start the battle. This dude is running. Okay, finally, the battle has started. All right, here we go, man. Let's lead off with Kartana and just hope for the best. That's a Scrafty. Is that a Sfeel? I've got one goal in mind, and that's getting that Sfeel on my team, okay? I'm taking Sfeel 100%. I know there's got to be something special about that Sfeel, all right? Who else brings a Sfeel to the war zone if it's not legendary? So let's do it. We have won our second battle. Sfeel, you are mine. Feels good, man. It feels good. So we are one war zone win away from completing our goal. And here he is. The man who took our Registeel. I think it's only fitting that we battle again. This is the guy who's got rapid spin. This is the guy who's got sticky webs. And here is the Galarian Darmanitan, a Pokemon that's, I think this is banned now, honestly. Isn't that banned? Yo, and we just killed it in one shot. And just like that, we have won our third battle in the war zone and completed our goal. But what Pokemon do we take to celebrate, bro? I would love to take this Galarian Darm, but I'm gonna take Zerkatry. Let's go, baby. We get another legendary too. Oh my god, I am so happy. What a way to end off that challenge. Beating the guy who took our Registeel from us. All right, but now that we're done with the Warzone goal, we need to focus on our third and final goal, which is getting a full squad of Shinies to level 100. And it took me about nine days total to finish off that goal, so we have nine more Lucky Blocks to open. It would still be really cool to get Shinies or even another Shiny Legend. Legendary. I mean, come on. We don't need to have a shiny Caterpie on the team. Like, it can be a shiny Legendary. But all right, man. Let's get into these lucky blocks. Come on. We got a Pontiard. We got a Fomantis. We got Primarina. We got an upgrade, baby. Starting off great. We got, oh, Axu, but not a shiny. Definitely not a shiny. Electrike. We got a Swellow, which is actually a really good Pokemon. Next up is Squovet. Couldn't even see that guy. Then we got a Mamoswine. Yo, I'm gonna catch that. Hello, buddy. Welcome. And last but not least, let's see, man. Can we get another shiny and replace the shiny Caterpie? I'm not hated, man, but let's see. I am so excited, bro. Three, two, one, and it's a shiny herd here. So I guess Caterpie is uh, staying on the team. Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to introduce you to the full shiny squad. I got everyone up to level 100. Look at the homie, our shiny Huntail. All right, I left Caterpie as a Caterpie, and honestly, I really like shiny Machoke compared to shiny Machamp, so I just kept Machoke as is. But guys, with that, we have completed all three goals of the 100 Days in Lucky Block Pixelmon Challenge. But of course, we still have seven more Lucky Blocks to open, so let's do it, guys. Let's open the final Lucky Blocks of the challenge and see what we get. A Tangrowth. Come on, man. This is the end. We need something big and just like that we have a great 
block come on man if we get a legendary that would be a banger way to end off the video all right come on come on did i get scammed no we got two no way no way this is the best way to end off the video we just got two more uncommon blocks come on can we get another we got a silicobra and a Merrill. for a second i thought we got another but let's do it guys we have a chance at a legendary remember let's end this video off with a bang oh <laughs> yo let's go all right we got to open the other ones first a shiny motham and a shiny totodile but what will be the final lucky block of our 100 days in lucky block pixelmon challenge it's gonna be a tabu bulu so we do end off the challenge with a legendary on a high note thank you guys so much for watching the video definitely make sure you leave a like if you enjoyed and subscribe if you haven't already i got a ton of cool pixelmon content planned and of course remember the server ip is mc.pokesmash.co if you guys want to play too but until next time thanks for watching